Restoration of Acid Grassland on Mitcham Common History Mitcham Common lies on Thames gravels, giving a thin, nutrient-poor soil of an acid nature. Historically, it was too poor for growing crops, so the land was left to be grazed by the animals of local people. This produced flower-rich grasslands, abundant in wildlife and restricted trees. However, grazing had ceased by the early 20th century, and gradually the grasslands were lost to scrub encroachment. Management. It is not practical to use grazing to prevent scrub encroachment on the common, so all of the scrub clearance is done manually. This is labour intensive, but is proving successful with tracts of acid grassland enlarging yearly. It's important to negotiate the numerous anthills which play an important part in the makeup of the habitat. Legislation. Acid grassland is a UK biodiversity action plan habitat because of its scarcity with only an estimated 1,300 hectares left in London, most of these under serious threat being neglected or developing into scrub. Many of the plant, invertebrate and bird species are protected under the Wildlife and Countryside Act 1981. Mitcham Common is designated as a metropolitan site of importance for nature conservation. Conservation Scrapes to restore acid grassland coverage, suitable areas such as this are selected for scrub removal following by mechanical scraping. Here, the nutrient-rich top layer of soil is removed, leaving nutrient-poor soil which can be seeded with locally sourced acid grass. Species Some plants and animals you may see include sheep's sorrel, heath bedstraw, tom and till, Mouse hair hawkweed, harebell, bee wolf, small copper, meadow pipit, skylark, and stoat. Bare soil is also important for burrowing insects, and the common houses various nationally rare burrowing bees and wasps. The bare ground also provides warm patches to bask for lizards, spiders, and insects. The distinctive mounds in the grassland are anthills of the yellow meadow ant, the main food source for the green woodpecker. Threats. The main threats to acid grassland are encroachment from scrub and nutrient enrichment from dog feces, leaf litter and atmospheric pollution. If nutrient enrichment is allowed to develop, the fine grasses such as common bent and red fescue are replaced with coarser species like Yorkshire fog and ryegrass, with the delicate flowers being lost to nettles and species more suited to the enrichment.